One of the areas most keenly contested amongst car manufacturers these days is the sports utility vehicle market. That's a 4x4 with alloys to you and me. Well, the competition just got even keener with this, the Vauxhall Frontera Sport V6. Now, you might more commonly associate a car like this with a trip to the supermarket or the twice daily school run, but we've come to the Brecon Beacons in Wales to put this car through its paces where it really matters, and that is off-road. <laughs> Now most 4x4 manufacturers have purpose-built tracks that demonstrate what the car can do and not too much of what the car can't. Well here we're going seriously off-road, down a Roman road through the Brecon Beacons. And uh, this isn't purpose-built because we're free to go anywhere and if we get stuck, we get stuck. Now this car's permanent rear-wheel drive for on-road use, but if you're in Sainsbury's and you hit a bit of ice and you want to go four-wheel drive, then like so many 4x4s these days, there's a switch where you can change on the go. A quick demonstration for you to show you how good the four-wheel drive is on a slippery surface. This first corner is in four-wheel mode, no problems. This second one is just rear-wheel drive. The less said the better. So, how are we doing with our quest to find out if the Frontier can hack it off-road? Well, I have to say, I'm reasonably impressed. You wouldn't have thought any car could go places we've been today, let alone a Vauxhall. I'm a snob. It hasn't got the 4x4 pedigree, but it can do it. Wow, that's the Frontier Sport V6. It really does deliver a lot more than it promises off-road. And at five or less than 20 grand, it represents absolutely brilliant value for money. And if you're looking for a car that you want to do the kids' school run in and perhaps the shopping, well, it'll do that as well. <laughs>